if you're a no-code designer coming from a no-code background, coming from a non-design background, you definitely know that you need design inspiration. I need design inspiration. Yes, I, mean, I came from marketing all the way to no-code. I need design inspiration. You need design inspiration. And what's the best place to get design inspiration? Pinterest, of course. Everybody posts everything on Pinterest. Everything that has to do with images, everything. You're looking for a ring, you're going to Pinterest, you're looking for the best clothes to wear, you're going to Pinterest, you're looking for the best home design, you're going to Pinterest. How about looking for the best, the best mobile app layer on Pinterest? Awesome, right? You just need to have the best keyword. That's the only thing you need to have. Just put in the right keyword and allow Pinterest to do the rest. So I just put app design here, which is a bogus, you know, such an everyday keyword, very high volume keyword. That's what you, I just put here, but somehow you can also put something, you know, you can put like a marketplace. Let's say you're designing the marketplace, right? And you need design and inspiration for your marketplace. So you can just put it in there. Marketplace app design. And now you see all these applications with so much screen. Like, let's check out this one. This is a car marketplace kit, you know? This is a car marketplace kit. And you're seeing how it's done. You're seeing like the... You know, the getting started, you're seeing all this part of it, you're seeing all of it. And the goal is not to copy. The goal is to see how things are placed, how the layers are done. Because some of these things are done by professionals. The goal is to see how these things are done so you can have an idea of how to implement this in your application. So see, we have this other one. This is a restaurant UI. And you're seeing, oh, this is the way I could place my home screen. This is the way I could place my, my, my UI. This is the way I could place my shopping cart. This is the way I could, you know, do all this stuff for myself on Flutterflow or an, on Adalo or an, any other no code you I'm using. And then it's starting to come alive to you, right? It's starting to come alive to you. You're starting to get inspiration. And now your mind is full. And when you're going back to the tool that you use, when you're going back to Flutterflow or any other tool you use, your mind is super open and now you can think and you can make you can just you know you can just think and you can see what you can design with all of this tool so you can just keep clicking you know just keep clicking this is a full delivery app template keep keep clicking keep seeing exactly what is that what you're looking for and once you see it then you can always pin it that's the thing. You can once you see it, you can create a board. You know, you can create a board or add it to your board. Like you know, you can just add it to your board right there once you see it. Or you can download this as an image and keep it. So this is where you can find awesome inspiration on Pinterest. You can use it. Just make sure that you're searching for the right keyword. Yeah, just make sure you're searching for the right keyword. You can be like, let's say, social media app layout. So this is an app layout for social media uh, application. So let's just click this. So you can see dating, relationship, and social media app kit. So you can see how it is. This is like a Pinterest, a, a, a not Pinterest. This is like a, um, this is an application where people get to swipe, dingo, dango. I'm not very sure what the app is right now, but it's a very popular dating application. People get to swipe left or right. I barely use any. Have a beautiful girlfriend. So I barely use it. But this is something that can give you inspiration. If you're working in the crypto space, you can even go ahead and type like crypto, crypto application, crypto app UI, you know, put it in there. And now you're seeing some UIs that have to do with crypto. You can see the way it is, and you can go back to Flutterflow or, or, and, or any other tool that you use and design something awesome like this. You see, it's coming together, right? This is how you find ideas. This is how you find design inspiration on Pinterest. Go ahead, check it out. Let me know what you think in the comment section below and let me see the magic that you're going to be creating. Don't forget, you want to get started with no code. I have some awesome tutorials right there. Click on the link below to find the one that's right for you. I'll see you soon in the next tutorial. Definitely. Bye.